Hey Windows Phone fans, I'm Mark for WP Central. In this video, we are checking out Adobe Photoshop Express. It has been available on iOS, Android, and Windows devices, but now Windows Phone users can join the fun. All right, let's take a look. So this is what you'll see when you open up Adobe Photoshop Express. You can capture a photo from within the application or you could select one from your camera roll. I have a lot of screenshots here. Uh, let me select uh, this one. Okay, so like all other image editing apps, you have uh, adjustments. So let's go over there. You can change your clarity, sharpen, exposure, contrast, highlights, shadows, temperature. Uh, what most, what I like to do is increase the vibrance just a little bit. I would also want to increase the clarity just a little bit and maybe the exposure. Uh, but take a look at this. You have an auto option. Click on that and uh, it will automatically um, set the proper exposure for your photo. And you, you can see th that the image is getting better as we go. If you take a look here at the bottom, there are three binds, uh, undo, quick fix, and see original. Click on see original and you can see the, the original photo before the edits were done. So that's a good way to compare your original to your edited photo. So even though you have all these controls, clarity, sharpen, exposure, contrast, and you have these sliders as well, my favorite feature is uh, this quick fix button at the bottom. Just click on it once and it will automatically change the exposure, shadows, uh, basically it will do the magic trick for you. And you can see right away that the image looks much better. And if you're not happy with the quick fix, you could jump into the individual settings and uh, select your adjustments for you. So, so you could see the quick fix button, increase the contrast a little bit. It also changed the highlights. Uh, but again, if you're not happy with that, you could decrease it a little bit, just like that. Or maybe you want to change the temperature a little bit instead of auto, make it look cooler. Like that, but uh, like I said, the quick fix is the magic button and it makes photos immediately look better. So here's the original photo. And now let's take a look at the edited photo. Let's go back to the original photo and then the edited photo. If you prefer filters, then Adobe Photoshop Express also provides that. Uh, check out looks. Uh, there are over 20 filters available or looks. Uh, check out winter, summer, autumn, and uh, these are free, but there are also premium looks available. I believe there are 20 looks in this premium package and uh, it costs $2.99. And you could go ahead and buy that by uh, confirming the purchase over here, $2.99 for the Adobe Looks Pack. Another cool feature is the red eye removal tool. Let's take a look at the photo here. Uh, since I used flash, you can see that there's a uh, red eyes over here. There's an auto fix button, but I find that that doesn't really work. Uh, in order to, for you to remove the red eye, you just click on the red eye just like that, and that will remove it, and click on the other eye, and that will remove it as well. And then you just click on the check button. And if you're still not convinced with Adobe Photoshop Express, there's one tool that's my absolute favorite. Uh, let's go ahead to adjustments and take a look at reduce noise. Uh, just slide it a little bit to 19 and uh, you'll notice that it will reduce the, the grain in this photo just like that. However, you have to keep in mind that if you apply too much noise reduction, it's going to make your photo look creamy and it's not going to be as sharp as before. So you have to do a little bit of moderation with this option. Noise reduction is also available as an in-app purchase for $4.99. So that's a quick look at Adobe Photoshop Express. It's a free download at the Windows Phone Store. Check it out and let us know if it's going to be your favorite image editor for Windows Phone. All right, that should be it. I'm Mark for WP Central. Thanks for watching.